God can and will touch you and make you whole, W-H-O-L-E, when before you had a whole, H-O-L-E. My friend, often we feel like we have holes in us, that no matter how much we try to sleep, no matter how much we try to replenish ourselves, we're like a bucket with holes. We're leaking, and we can't seem to stay full. Well, God can touch, and God can heal, and God can mend the broken places. You become stronger where you're mended. It says in the Bible, the righteous will live by God's faith. That is the real way to live our life, to live in absolute faith and to know that God is touching and God is mending. There's a story in the Bible of a suffering woman. This suffering woman just simply reached out her hand to touch the hem of Jesus' garment. And he turned and he said, Daughter, be of good comfort. Thy faith has made thee well. Well, we too might be made whole if we'll just reach out in our faith to touch our Creator. Our Creator is not done creating us. We can be recreated at any time. Many times it's not our bodies that need healing. Perhaps it's our mind. Or perhaps it's our soul. When God touches us and recreates us, we are made new. We're made well. Strengthen your faith. Strengthen it through praise, through worship, Attend the church of your choice. And the most important thing is that you attend and that you are infilled. But something else is happening besides an infilling. It's also a healing of the broken places. Reading the Bible is a great thing to do on a daily basis. And, of course, what we stress here, prayer. Trust God's plans, knowing that they are always your ultimate benefit in your life. Often, when we go into prayer, we'll be told of God's plans for our life. And I have had times where it seemed like the answer was so strange, so foreign to me, encouraging me to do something that I had no idea how to do. And yet, if I would proceed in that direction, it would be exactly what I need. And when I've been wise enough to do that, it has been the greatest blessing that my life could ever know. Jesus right now is standing at the door of your heart and knocking. And if you open that door of your heart and invite him in, He will give you peace, and He'll heal, and He'll create a mend where before there was a broken spirit. God will absolutely touch you, and the Creator will recreate your life. God will give you faith where before you didn't have faith, belief where before you didn't have belief. And God will heal even the smallest fragment of uh, our, our souls that are frayed, uh, that need to be re sown with a strength and a might where it cannot be torn apart. I pray this for you. I pray that you have faith, and I pray that you have wellness in that faith.